Hi, how are you? Welcome back to the vlog series. You know, where we do a bunch of cool stuff and do nothing. But we're gonna make it a little bit interesting before we get to all those exciting things. I have to do my daily shit and wake up in the morning. So the first thing I usually do in the morning is I brush my teeth. You know, it's just time for a fresh new start. Clean up the face a little bit, just give that fresh new look. You know, that fresh, cleanly cut. So I think I must just look like a little kid again. But now that that's done, next phase is probably gonna be to do something with this fucking hair. It's just not on point. It's just not on point. Now the next thing is I gotta cut my fingernails and my toenails. When you cut your fingernails and toenails, are you the guy that just leaves your toenail stuff on the floor? At bro. Pro tip. Do your toenails and your fingernails in the bathtub so that you can just turn the water on and let it flow down the drain instead of being the guy that just leaves it all over the ground. Straight nasties. I really can't wait to the day of my life where I can just confidently go and get my toes and my nails done without having that feeling of feminosity. You know what I'm saying, fellas? Sometimes you just want to get your shit done too. <sighs> this nail almost got cut off in the ninth grade. It's a shot class, using one of those big cutter things. Slip this guy right in there, see how it's just off, not even. Like, I legit almost cut my finger off. If you cut your nails, and when you cut them, they jump off and they fling and shoot you back in the face, your nails are too long. It's too long, don't let them get like that no more. It's a dangerous weapon, you could hurt somebody. So I got a few things to do today. I got a package in the mail. It's actually kind of dope. Not bad shirt. Might wear it today, might not. But if you guys don't know, um, one of my companies is kind of like a media company where we do advertising and promotions for brands and other companies so people can get eyeballs on them and they can eventually purchase them. So let's get to those product pictures. Those product pictures that I gotta take for this shirt gotta be done on the Beamer. That's what that's what that's what the guy wants. You gotta give the people what they want. So yeah. I think the guy probably wants me to take one of me in the shirt too, huh? It's a pretty dope shirt. It's so hard to take pictures of yourself of your, by yourself. Like, where's my photographer when I need him? I think that's good. He's, but he's just got to work what he got. Like, I'm a one man show here. It's the best I can do right now. So.
so I come outside just to find out that <laughs> my yard is engulfed in flames. It's just smoky. See where it's <laughs> So yeah, I guess we just light fires. Three fires, we got three fires going. That's really great that they're doing this because that kind of plays a part to what I have next coming on. Oh, I'm so pumped out about this. So today's whole vlog is about... Basically the whole point of the whole video is to kind of show you what I got going on in my little, what do you want to call it? Uh, whatever it is. So this whole video has to do about my backyard. I'm turning it into a super cross track. Not really super cross track, more of like a trail for my motorbike, bicycle, motorbike, whatever you want to call it. But look at all this space I got back here. It's just, I have all this room back here. Nobody else is doing anything with it. I like to ride dirt bikes, four wheelers, anything with speed, I'm into it. So literally like, why not? Something can come down to the yard, pop in here, come this way, hard right, come around this tree. Look at all this room back here. I can just tear all this up. Take this little right, keep hauling ass through here. Get a little uphill, maybe take a little turn. This could be my little jump. Come around. Oh, this is gonna be a nice track. Dude, I can run through them. Coming around here, hitting the little wobbles, the bump, pop open here. Boom, avoid that hole. Definitely stay away from the hole. I might fill it up with snakes. I might fill up this pit with snakes and alligators, so if you fall in, it's absolutely game over, wasted. So I might bust this way. Come around, come around, bust around this tree right here. So I'll come around. Bust around this U-turn. Come out of here. Maybe when this dries up, all of this water, I can definitely, definitely use this to my advantage. Maybe even bust across the creek right there, the creek, the creek, the cricker, and then bust right across the lake, the river, come back across. Or not come through this way, busting. Dean, dean, dean. Maybe take a hard left here, or a hard right, bust through here. We're just busting. Remember this whole time? We're just busting through here the whole time. Hard turn right here. Busting right back up here again. Come this way. Through the backyard. Hit this little bump. Come through here. And then it's the straightaway. You know every, you know every track has to have a straightaway on it. That's the best part. Yeah. Downshift, downshift, downshift. And I'm right back in the shits. And we're back at it again. So that looks like that's gonna be our track. All right, perfect. Now that we have the trap mapped out, walked around, laid it out, time to put the, the guy lines up, the railing up. <sighs> now we gotta find something to use, piece of string, rope, whatever. And we have to map out the track. We have to go around the track. So when I'm in the midst of I know exactly which way I'm going. You know what I'm saying? Now that we have a large amount of twine to map out our track, now we have to actually physically map out the track. You have some duct tape, some painter's tape, some army cord, some, I don't know, some more army cord. I need this thing. This thing looks like it could do some damage. Broom, let's make the ground nice and clean. Cut down all those unwanted trees, thorn bushes. <laughs> Last but not least, a hose. 
phase one is complete. The track is looking really good. Like, and while I'm out there, I'm always just coming up with new ideas, and I think I might have to get some dirt hauled in so I can make some jumps. <laughs> These guys over here building this house, they got tons of free dirt over there. So I'm gonna have to just grab me a wheelbarrow one day and just go over there and snag some. I'll even ask that dude if he can drive over here real quick just to make me a little bump. A little bumpity bump, that'd be cool. Time to crank this bad boy up and let's, let's see if we can get some laps in. See if we can um, get some times in, see what, see, what, see what it's looking like. Freaking hype, dude. Punk. It's getting dark. I wish I could be out here riding tomorrow. Uh, all day tomorrow. No business. I'm just riding all day. Uh, bring her on in. That was nice. Dang, I knew I forgot to do something. Kids, do not ride motorbikes without your helmet. It is dangerous. And I do not condone it. Hi, hi, girl. Did you see me out there? Did you see me riding? Did you see me riding? I was riding. Did you see? Did you see me? Did you see me though? Oh man, what a day, dude. Very creative, Barry. Even though like I wasn't productive. Business-wise, I was super productive creativity in on the vlog. It's about 7.30 p.m. That's pretty much about it. How can we end this vlog? How do you want to end the vlog? Hey, how do you want to end the vlog? Sit. 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 Thank you. How do you how do you want to end this vlog? You weren't even in the vlog very much. Ah, Gucci was too busy today. Will you be in the vlog tomorrow? Are you gonna come back for them tomorrow? Look, it's them. Say hi.
that's it for episode two. Um, why don't you guys come back tomorrow and let's hang out. I'll be the day. I'm trying to learn German. Another way I'm investing in myself is I'm learning another language. And I was born in Germany for some of those that didn't know, so why not? I'm gonna learn, I'm learning German. Hello is hello. And Al Wiedersehen is goodbye. Al Wiedersehen. Come and come and collect, better prepare. Show me your face. I need a way. Is anybody gonna be there? Show me the way and what to be well. Cause I'm good, stick with my creator. Cause I know the devil's my biggest hater.